Grace Arena Ministries, this is the place where we transform lives and maximize potentials. We're here to connect with God through worship, prayer, and fellowship. We're here to grow in the knowledge of God's word. We're here to serve God with our lives, families, and resources. And we're here to expand to the unreached in the nations of the world. If today's your first time of visiting us, we'd like you to know that we love you and we appreciate your visit. If you're searching for a Bible-believing church where you can grow in the knowledge of the word of God, then your search has come to an end. Our hospitality team will meet you and give you a visitor's pack and offer you some refreshments. There is a brochure in the pack with a detailed section. Please could you complete it and hand it back to the hospitality team. Our prophet will meet you at the end. Please be aware of our housekeeping rules. There are two fire exits in the building, one to my right and one through the door. We only hope to experience the Holy Ghost fire, but in case of physical fire, please use the fire exits as shown. If you want to use the toilets, they're right through the door. They're gents and ladies just outside the door. Our Grace Children's Service is opposite our auditorium. Mothers, please be assured that your children are safe with our Sunday school teachers. They'll be taught the Word of God and they'll grow in the knowledge of God's Word. Here in Grace Arena, we serve God with our lives, our families and resources. Please be sure to serve in any one of our departments and God will surely bless you. Grace Arena Ministries is one church at different locations. Please take note of our different service and location times. We meet at the Gethsemane Centre, Shakespeare Road, Brixton, SW98RR. We meet on Wednesdays between 6.30pm and 9pm and on Sundays between 5.30pm and 8pm. We also meet at the Empowerment Centre, Unit 7 and 8, 13 Argyle Avenue, Leighton, E10 7QE. We meet on Fridays between 7pm and 9pm and on Sundays between 11.30am to 2pm. Thank you and God bless you. Hello, God bless you. I hope you are doing well. Did you know that there are prophetic significance of numbers? Every number has its own meaning. Likewise, every month has got its own prophetic significance. Number one is the number of unity. Two is the number of union. Three is the number of God. We've got God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Four is the number of the world because there are four cardinals in the world. Five is the number of grace. Six is the number for man because man was created on the seventh day. Seven is the number for perfection because on the seventh day, God said everything was perfect after he created. And it also means completion because on the seventh day, everything was completed. Eighth is the number for new beginning and nine is the number for birthing or spiritual manifestation. What am I trying to tell you? In this ninth month of the year is the time spiritually that things are spiritually birthed. It's either you take your time, pray, seek the face of God to birth something prophetic for your life and your family or the enemy will birth something negative in your life. We will not sit down for the enemy to release negativity into our lives. That is why I want to invite you from this Monday, the 7th of September to next week, Tuesday, the 15th of September to nine days of fasting and prayer. In during this time, we are going to spiritually birth anything that God has in store for our lives. I know you have fasted many times. Possibly you didn't get what you wanted and sometimes you got what you wanted. But this prophetic season and time is a time I want you, yes you, you that is watching this video to be part of it. Try and join me online on Grace Hour for this nine days of birthing. It's going to be awesome, powerful and, and, and prophetic. You will get to know the mind of God concerning your life and your situation. As the Lord lead us, we are going to in, go into intense prayer for a shift in our lives and our families. I want to invite you. This is a personal invitation for you. Please join me Monday, the 7th of September to Tuesday, the 15th of September for nine days of birthing in prayer and fasting. Your life will never ever 
never be the same again god bless you as we meet on grace hour on my facebook channel prophet david always you just connect with it and your life will never be the same again please take this as a personal invitation god bless you i love you bye evening i am expectant and i'm sure that you are also if you've joined us and you haven't shared the broadcast please kindly do so because something is about to happen tonight hallelujah amen 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 we bless god we bless god somebody even this moment could you please open your mouth and thank god just thank god he's a good god there is no one like you jesus we bless you. Your children have gathered once again to give you our thanksgiving because you deserve it. Father, you are worthy of it all. We bless you. We bless you. We bless you. We bless you, Jesus. Father, we adore you. Lord, we honor you. There is none like you. Somebody open your mouth and bless Jesus. Somebody bless Jesus. Father, you are worthy of our praise. Father, you are worthy of our praise. We exalt you. King of glory, we bless you. Take all the glory tonight. Take all the glory tonight. We give you glory, Jesus. We exalt you, mighty name. For you are so worthy, you are so worthy, Jesus. There is none like you, my Lord and my King. We bless you, Abba Father. We bless you, Abba Father, King of glory. We have come to bow before your throne, and we exalt your holy name. For we say there is none like you, Lord. Father, there is none like you, Lord. Oh, you are wonderful. Only you are wonderful. We sing you are glorious. You are my healer, yes, you are my provider, oh, you are my peace, Lord, you are my sustain, Lord, I am nothing without you, Lord, that's why we worship you, King of glory, that's why we worship you, King of glory, somebody worship wherever you are, the Lord deserves your worship tonight. Father, we bless you, we bless you, we bless you. We sing, you are wonderful. You are worthy, oh Lord. You are wonderful. You are worthy, oh God. You are wonderful. You are worthy, oh Lord. You are wonderful, yeah. You are worthy, oh Lord. We sing, You are wonderful. You are worthy, oh Lord. You Somebody tell me sing it out. Yes, you are, you are one. Oh Lord, you are worthy. There is none like you, Jesus. Yes, you are. Oh, you are wonderful. You are wonderful. Hallelujah. Father, we bless you. Oh, you are, you are, you are. Hey. 
join the host of angels in heaven and we bound ourselves to the 24 elders and we bow before your mighty throne and we sing holy 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 Thank 
up in your voice. his name. Just continue to bless his name. Continue to lift him up. Continue to lift him up. Hey, brados in the bra. Rebados in the same atmosphere. In the same atmosphere of worship. So mighty God, I bless your name. Only one, I worship you. You are God all by yourself. You are God all by yourself. Mighty God, sing it. And mighty God, I bless your name. I bless your name. Call him the Holy One, Holy One. I worship you, I worship you. You are God, you are God all by yourself. You don't share your glory, no man. You are God, you are God all by yourself. Wherever you are, lift your hands, lift your voice. Call you the mighty God, mighty God. I bless your name. I bless your name, Holy One, Holy One. I worship you, God. You are God. You are God of us. You are God of us. You are God. Lift your voice, lift your hands, and we sing it. And all creation, all creation, shout his name, shout his name with us. You are God, you are God of us. You are God of us. You are God.
Were there not ten people that I healed? Where are the nine? Today is the last day of the prophetic extreme Shabbat, and we want to lift our voice and give God thanks. Wherever you are, begin to give God thanks. You are alive today not because you are too smart, not because you are too righteous. But it's by His grace. And I want you, whenever you are, to lift your voice and begin to show gratitude to God tonight.
the soil you can do tonight is enough. Sing away, away. Somebody lift up your voice, just begin to bless him right here. Lift up your voice and bless the Lord. Lift up your voice and magnify him. Come on, lift up your voice and worship him. He can't let it go, Shabbat. He can't let it go, Shabbat. 
Father, we thank you tonight. We sing that let the Asians worship parish tonight like never before. Speak to us and we shall be spoken unto. In the mighty name of Jesus. And everyone shouted amen. amen. Wherever you are watching me from, I want you to share the broadcast for me. Share it into 20 Facebook groups you are in right now. As you share, may God multiply your blessing. Go with me to Luke chapter 11. I'm preparing your heart tomorrow, tonight for what we are beginning tomorrow. Tomorrow we are starting a nine days of fasting and prayer. And I want to gear you up for what is about to happen. Now, this world we live in exist in two parts. There is the physical world and there is the spiritual world. This part of the world is called the physical world. In the physical world, one plus one is two and two plus two is four. In the physical world, you must move by a means of transport before you go to where you want to get to. In the physical world, I can see you and you can see me. In the physical world, when you add a thousand to a thousand, you get two thousand. There is the other dimension of the world called the spirit realm of the spirit world. That is the real world. When you read Genesis 1, the Bible says, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. That was a coded language. It was a spiritual language. What it simply means that in the beginning, God created the spirit realm and the physical realm. The earth is where we live. Here is the physical realm. Here on the earth is called the physical realm. And there is another world, another realm where you cannot see with your physical eyes. That place is called the spirit realm or the spirit world. In the spirit realm, one plus one can be ten thousand, and two plus two can be a hundred thousand. In the spirit realm, that is where destinies are manufactured. In the spirit realm, that is where lives are manufactured. In the spirit realm, that is where anything that proceeds here in the physical proceeds from the spirit. There is nothing that happens here in the physical, not unless it has happened in the spirit. For someone to prosper and do well in the physical here on the earth, it must have first happened in the spirit. For someone to die, for any evil thing to also happen, it is first conceived in the spirit before it is birthed in the physical. In fact, for your information, even you, you were first in the spirit before God picked you and put you in the womb of your mother. Let me tell you, 
Here on the earth, it's a playback. It is just that we are just playing the movie that has already been acted. You are just playing that which has already been acted in the spirit. But the thing is that because you don't have spiritual eyes, you cannot see. Yeah. Uh, let me explain. Someone testified this week how for seven years she has never gotten a job. And I prophesied that in the month of September she will get a job and she got it. How? How did it happen? Because in the spirit it was already recorded that in September she will get a job. So I just enter into the spirit, download that which is on the mind of God concerning the person and tell it to the person in time let me tell you something here how can someone say um, they have applied for visa several times not being given and I tell them go this time it shall be given why because it was what was established in the spirit realm I download it and pour it in the physical let me explain something to you. I personally define prayer as a divine vehicle that transports that which is in the spirit into the physical. Let me explain to you. Prayer, my personal definition in this my book, by making prophetic decrees in prayer, I explain prayer as a divine vehicle that transports that which is in the spirit that which God has established on his mind it transports it from the spirit realm and releases it here in the physical so when you pray what you are literally doing is that you are aligning yourself so that that which God has said in the spirit is fulfilled here in the physical so when you read Jeremiah chapter 1 verse 5, God says to Jeremiah, Jeremiah, before I formed you in your mother's womb, I knew you and I had ordained you a prophet. In other words, before Jeremiah could even be in the mother's womb, he was a prophet. He, all, he was already a prophet in the spirit. Jeremiah's mother and father were just conduits. They were just channels by which God released a man called Jeremiah in the spirit here on the earth. Jeremiah already existed. What am I trying to say? There was a man called John who already existed. There is a lady called Mercy who is already existing in the spirit. Everything that God wants to do in your life is already established in the spirit. So this week, what we are doing is simple. When we enter into the spirit, we now engage prayer, which is the divine vehicle to transport that which is in the spirit down here in the physical. Listen to me. You may be so blessed in the spirit, but in the physical, you may be a broke man. In the spirit, you may be a millionaire, but right now you may be struggling. In the spirit, you may be married with children, but now in the physical, nothing like that is happening. All you've got to do is to download yourself and position yourself and begin to pray that which is in the spirit concerning your life here in the physical so this week we are going to engage the divine vehicle of God to move that which God has said concerning our lives from the spiritual perspective into the physical so listen, imagine Jeremiah was born and, and at the age of 8 and 12 and 15 or 20, the man was struggling and he, he doesn't know what to do and possibly he's asking questions. Why is life difficult? Why am I not breaking through? Why? And, and asking all the whys that you ask. 
all Jeremiah needed to do was to engage and begin to pray. Kadu Adi, Idibi Abranta, Ikerere Bosha. What Jeremiah will be doing is to release the divine vehicle to transport that which is on the mind of God from the spirit into the physical. This week, Hadi Azuta, we will decree and declare, uh, let that which God has said Jesus. concerning our lives, concerning our ministries, concerning our marriage, concerning our finances, Amen. concerning our business, Amen. we will declare, Jesus. let it be fulfilled in our lives. Let me tell you, if you fail to pray, it's like this. It's like God having a cargo. A cargo at the port. Maybe a, a, a container full of treasures at the port. Ready to ship it to you. But your prayer is the shipping. That will move it from the port to you. There are so many treasures. Check the scriptures. The Bible said, for we are blessed with all spiritual blessings in the heavenly places. But why are you struggling? If we are blessed with all spiritual blessings, why are you not married? If we are blessed with all spiritual blessings, why are things so difficult for you? The reason is you have not positioned yourself to download that blessing that God has already obtained concerning your life to be formed here in the physical. God said to Jeremiah, son, before you appeared here, you were already a prophet. Can, can I also paraphrase it for you? Before you even appeared here, you were already a great man of God. Amen. Before you appeared here, you were already a millionaire. Amen. Before you appeared here, you were already married. Amen. Before you appeared here, you already had children. Amen. Before you appeared here, you were already successful. Amen. Today, all we will do this week is to download through in prayer whatever God has established concerning our lives listen if you don't pray what you will be doing is this you will sit down for the enemy to release to you what he has also orchestrated in the spirit and most of us you are going through what you are going through because you failed to position yourself and download that which God has said concerning your life are you ready this week? This week is going to be fire for fire. Intensive nine days, not ten, not eleven, not seven, but nine. Because, listen to me, let me break some things down to you. The number nine signifies the, na the month of birthing. It's the number for birthing. You, when you were conceived, many people are born in the ninth month. It is the month by which, in which divine destinies are birthed. It is the month that determines even your, the following year, how the year should be to you. It is, it is the month that begins the ember month. We call some months the ember month. When you start mentioning the month, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, what else? September, October. November and December. September bears the ember months and the ember months are the most prophetic months of the year with September being the chief month. That is why from now most intense, most demonic activities intensify and most people who know how to position themselves in the spirit Jesus. and download that which God has said Jesus. concerning their lives Jesus. shall also give birth to testimonies this man. Amen. For your information, in case you didn't know, let me break the news to you. This month actually determines what will happen to the rest of your months in the in the coming year. Actually, September, when you check the Jewish calendar, man of God, September begins the Jewish calendar. According to Jews, this is the first month. It is a prophetic defining month. Let me tell you, let me read some statistics to you that will blow your mind. Great things happen in the month of September. Equally, the most dangerous evil things also happen in the month of September. Listen, in September 8th, 1900, that was when the greatest natural disaster in the world ever happened. That killed eight. 
thousand people and destroy twenty-five thousand buildings in one day, September eighth, nineteen hundred. A hurricane hit America, and 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 and, and, and over eight thousand people died, and twenty-five thousand houses were destroyed in one day, September eighth. In the same. In another day, in another year, 1941, September 8th, that was when the greatest number of Russians died. September 8th, greatest hurricane. September 8th, 1941, greatest number of Russians died in September 8th, 1941. When the German army began to destroy and kill over 1 million Russians in one day, September 8th. September 8th. And in September 8th, 19, 1974, that was when one American president resigned. Same day, September 8th. What are you talking about? Do you think it is a coincidence that all these demonic activities are happening in just one year, September? It is not a coincidence. It is a demonic witchcraft manipulated that makes evil things happen in the Jesus. month of September. An American president resigns in September 8th. Let me tell you, in September again, in this country, London, the greatest disaster that ever happened in the UK happened in the month of September. September 2nd, 1666. They call it the Great Fire of London. In September 9, 1776, that was when the name United States were birthed, was birthed. Listen to me, in the month of September, it is a month that the demonic activities intensify. And they know that anything demonic they do, it can happen in the month of September. Likewise, as the church of God and as believers, we must be spiritually proactive to know we will not sit down for the enemy to plan evil in the month of September. Amen. We will declare, let every conspiracy, Jesus. every demonic agenda Jesus. that has been conceived, Jesus. Let it be a potter. 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 Let me give you one more thing. Tomorrow we will continue. In September 11, 2001, that was when the greatest terrorist attack happened in the world. September 11. They call it the 9 11. The greatest terrorist attack happened in America. Let me tell you, September is not an ordinary month for your information. It is a serious spiritual month that even the people in the other occultic kingdom, the people in strange societies, they know this is the month to do things. It is the month that birthed the ember month. Today, we will not sit down. Jesus. And watch, like ignorant people, yeah. we will declare, let that which God has said concerning our lives Jesus. be fulfilled. Amen. Let me say something. When you read Matthew chapter 16, verse 19, Jesus said, I give unto you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. And I told you the heaven signifies where? The spirit realm. And the earth signifies where? The physical realm. See, I told you in the beginning, when God says in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. The heavens signifies the spirit realm and the earth signifies the physical realm. So when Jesus comes to say, I give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. And so whatever you bind on the earth, my God, shall Jesus. be bound in heaven. What Jesus was saying, I give you the spiritual keys that whatever you declare here in the physical shall be established in Jesus. the spirits, my God. And whatever you allow shall be allowed in the spirit. We are not here as people who don't know what we want to do. Jesus. We are here as informed believers Jesus. who know how to orchestrate, how to declare things here on the earth for it to be established in the spirit. Amen. If you didn't know, you have been mandated by God. That whatever you speak here in the physical, shall be established in the spirit. Amen. And whatever you declare here, you declare 
here in the physical shall be formed in the spirit. That is why a man of God can stand here in London and make a decree to somebody in Saudi Arabia, like yesterday. So those of you that, that I'm, I'm, I'm two, two days ago that were here, how somebody in Saudi Arabia, I could be here, pick up somebody in Saudi Arabia and declare doors are opening and doors open. Why? Because I believe this scripture that whatever I declare here on the earth is established in the spirit. Now that is why it, 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 I pity believers when they, 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 this, they don't value the words of a man of God. They don't value that because you know God, if you really know who you are in Christ and you come to the place where you believe in this kingdom, you know this kingdom works with principles and laws. And God has already declared, God has already declared that whatever we bind here on the earth is bound in the spirit. And whatever we lose here on the earth is loose in the spirit. And so, when you go to Isaiah 44 verse 26, the Bible says, I, the Lord, I, the Lord. I confirm the words of my servant and I perform the counsel. The word counsel means the acts the doings, the things of my messengers. So I know uh, God has told me when I stand and I declare over Helen Opondo, it will work. When I stand and I declare over Olivia, it will work. When I stand and I declare over Keith, it will work. When I stand and I declare over Joshua, it will work. When I stand and I declare over you, heaven will make it fulfilled. Are we ready? I'm just waiting your appetite for tomorrow. Listen to me and listen good. If you have never fasted, this is the time to fast. Only nine days. And if you know, I want you to call your friends, your cousins, your relatives. Engage them in this fasting. Make them fast. Because it's a spirit. See, I personally lack words to explain the, the, the importance of this month September. Because the spiritual dimensions of it is, is priceless. And if you connect well, I'm telling you, you shall bring it. Are you ready? We are ready. Are you ready? We are ready. We want to zoom in to prayer right now. God, do the earth. We are going to engage the atmosphere. You see, the other day, the Bible says, Daniel sought his face to fast and pray for the deliverance of Israel. And an angel was giving the answer. And the same day, the same day he began to pray, God gave the answer. But the principality withheld the angel in the spirit. To an extent that the angel could not break through. A demon had the audacity to stop the angel. Listen to me. We are not ignorant people. Before even we start praying and fasting tomorrow, we want to address every territorial power. Jesus. Any authority ah, that Judea. will try to interfere with your prayers. Jesus. You are here. Listen. I want you to share the broadcast. Share it right now. Share it right now. We are going to declare. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I decree and declare. I decree and declare. I decree and declare. I decree and declare. Every territorial power. Every territorial power. Every territorial power. Every territorial power. That will try to interfere. That will try to interfere. With my prayers this month. With my prayers this month. I declare. I declare. Catch fire. 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 Thank you. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Right now. Right now. I declare. I declare. I declare. I declare. I declare. I declare. Every territorial every power. Every territorial power. Every territorial power. Every territorial power. A sign. A sign. A sign. A sign. A sign. A sign. Against my destiny. Against my destiny. Against my prayers. Against my prayers. Right now. Right now. Catch fire. 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 Lift up your voice and pray. Territorial 
anybody, anybody that has said, that has said over, my life, over my life, I will not rise. I could not rise. Anybody, anybody that has said, that has said over, my life, over my life, I will not rise. I will not rise. Today, today catch fire. 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 Cat
Now we are going to release blessings. Listen. Let me tell you. In this same man that is evil, that is when also great things happen. In this man, anything you do prophetically will work. I'm telling you. Because it is a release. It's a release. Are you ready? Yes, we are ready. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Now, let me read this scripture. In Joshua chapter 21. And then we are going to zoom to the next level. This place is heated, my God. Joshua. Joshua. Joshua chapter 21. Joshua 21. Verse 45. Hear the word of the Lord. Jesus. Say, not one of the good promises which God had spoken to the house of Israel Jesus. failed. The Bible says, not one, not, not one. a word of any of the good promises that was spoken by God to Israel failed. Not a single one failed. Jesus. I don't know what God told you. Jesus. Today, listen to me. Say after me, I am spiritually pregnant. I am spiritually pregnant. Say again, I am spiritually pregnant. I am spiritually pregnant. When a woman is pregnant, which man do they give birth? The ninth month. Which month are we in? Ninth. I am spiritually pregnant to give birth to my ministry, to give birth to my destiny. Today, say in the name of Jesus, I declare every promise, every prophecy God has spoken concerning my life. I give birth, 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 I give birth to my testimony, to my prophecy. Right now, right there is someone watching me from the U.S. Jesus. Your name is Joyce. Specifically, you go to Lighthouse Chapel. The Spirit of the Lord is saying, we should declare to you, this year, before December 31st, Jesus. You shall be on it. 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 You are the only girl in your family. Professor. I just heard God that choice is your season for honor. Amen. People don't see anything good in you. But I just heard God. Jesus. Because in the realm of the spirit, I saw an angel of the law carrying you on a chariot. And you were being on it. And that is how I know. Jesus. This before this year ends. Jesus. Choice, you shall be on it. You shall be on it. Choice, you shall be on it. You shall be on it. Choice, you shall be on it. Choice, you shall be on it. Receive 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 it. There 
is someone watching me. Your, your son-in-law is called Victor. Your grandson is also called Victor. Recently, your grandson had a dream. Thank you, Holy Spirit. And in the dream, it was so confusing that he didn't know what to do. He was restless in bed. And he even called you the following day and told you. And you prayed with him. The Spirit of the Lord is speaking to me Jesus. that I should declare, declare. over Victor Kamara. Victor Kamara. My spirit has been carried right now. And I have entered Celerion. And I am seeing this boy that the enemy want to use and, and frustrate and destroy. But say as the Lord, say yes, the Lord. Every, agenda every agenda from Celerion from against Victor Kamara, against Victor Kamara. Let, it catch fire. let 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 it catch fire. In the name of Jesus. Amen. It's your grandson. Is Victor Kamara. Comment right now and say I'm the one. And let me move on. The spirit of the Lord said I should speak to another lady by the name of Selena. Selena, say yes the Lord that that, that pain that has caused you years of tears, Jesus. the Lord says he is about to give you joy. Amen. Say yes the Lord we may yes, endure for a night. Jesus. But joy, joy comes, comes in the morning. The Lord is replenishing you with joy. Amen. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Now let's make this prayer. In this season, some of you, you will give birth to twins. Amen. No physical twins, but blessings in double. When we read the book of Isaiah chapter 61, God said, I will give you honor for your trouble. Jesus. Honor for your shame. Honor for your shame. I declare over you. Amen. Receive honor. Receive honor. Receive favor. Receive favor. Receive favor. Receive favor. Receive favor. Receive favor. How can you remember the testimony of Emilia? Emilia said, How I declared that the month of August she would meet a man. And a man from a man of God, where is the man from? Emilia's God. Germany proposed to her. And the man did not just propose with empty hands. Oh. He proposed with the house. Handle the house. Money. Jesus. My friend, you, you are proposing and giving you toffee, chocolate. Today, that Jesus. shame is over. It's over. I said that shame is over. It's over. I said that shame is over. It's over. I said that shame is over. It's 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 over. Jesus, if you are watching me and you need a breakthrough within the next 21 days, Jesus, receive it now. I receive it. 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 You see, the blessing that is going to be released, Jesus, it will blow your mind. It will blow your mind. Says, Prophet, I am the one. My grandson. And my son-in-law is called Victor. Hey. Jesus, Jesus. Come on, man. Jesus, hey. you are so good. Hey. Jesus, lift up your you voice. Are so kind. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do. Have done for me, Jesus, 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 you are so good, Jesus, 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 you are so kind. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me, Jesus. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me.
for me what no man can do. You have done for me what no man can do. You have done for me. Listen, listen, listen. Some of you, you don't understand the song that is being sung. The song goes like, Jesus, you have been so good. What my father could not do, what my mother could not do, you have done it for me. Now listen to me. We are going to sing it prophetically. Let me release a word over Victor and the family. Whatever they want to do against that boy, I cancel and cancel. Amen. And I release and declare. Let the hand of God. 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 Be released. Be released over the boy. Over the boy. In the name of Jesus. 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 Now listen, there is somebody who called Diana Willul. Diana. The spirit of the Lord is declaring to me right now that every form of premature death that goes on in the family today is terminated. Amen. Tonight, as we sing that song, I want you to, to sing it prophetically and testimonies shall be released this month. One, two, three. Go. Jesus, you are so good. Jesus, you are so kind. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. Jesus, yeah. you are so good. Jesus, yes, yes, yes. You are so kind. Well, what no man can do, you have done. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. You have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. Receive it. Receive it. You are watching me right now. You work with refugees. You work with refugees. The spirit of the Lord is telling me he is about to shift you. You are going to meet someone that through that person, the Jesus. Lord will change your location. Why? Jesus. Because they shall be, that person will help you gain international favor. 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 Receive. Receive it. There is someone watching me also. You come from Inkransa in Ghana. 
a place called in Kransa. A place called in Kransa. If you are the one, in the assignment of accident, Jesus. they have arranged for you specifically Jesus. on the 11th of the 11th of 2020, Prophesy. 11th November 2020. Prophesy. I re decree and declare, let it backfire, 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 receive, receive it. Receive international favor. Receive international favor. Receive international favor. Receive Receive it. There is a lady that is watching me. You had a dream. And your grandmother was fighting with you. And your grandmother was fighting with you. And somebody says, I am the one that works with mm. refugees. My God. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. Jesus, Jesus, you are so good. Jesus, 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 what no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. Sing Jesus. Hey. Ago, Jesus. I had a dream fighting with my grandmother. What Fight a God! What no man, man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done for me. What no man can do, you have done. your life may you receive international may favor. you receive international favor may god release one man jesus that will shift your location amen that will shift your location amen that will shift your location that will shift your location there is another lady also you are specifically born in the month of september you come from uganda jesus you are watching me right now professor you also had a dream and your grandmother was fighting with you. Mm. Also, two weeks ago, same as this other one, two weeks ago, you come from Uganda. Professor. You had a dream. Your grandmother was fighting with you. You were born in September, specifically the 12th of September. Uh -huh. Adi If you are the one, just comment right now and say, I am the one. We Abba. give glory to the Lord. He reigns.
What a God. Jesus. What a God. We give glory to the Lord. He reigns. We give hey, glory hey. to the Lord. He reigns. He reigns. He reigns. He reigns. He reigns. We give glory to the Lord. He reigns. He reigns. He reigns. He reigns. Oh, he reigns. We give glory to the Lord. We give glory. We give glory to the Lord.
Hallelujah. Let me pray over the, Luka, the lady from Uganda. Jesus. Woman, on the 12th of September, which is your birthday, that grandmother would have come back to fight you. Jesus. But today I stand as a prophet. Ah, Patonia. And I decree over you. I decree over you. Whatever she's looking for from whatever you. Whatever she's looking for. I command the sword of God. The sword of God. To strike. To strike. 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 By fire. By fire. A year by now. I declare over you. You shall be the talk of your family. Amen. Everybody in the family will gather to celebrate you. Amen. And make sure it happens in the month of September. That because that is what I heard. Jesus. Professor. Let me declare over you. There is a lady watching me. Specifically somebody owes you $2,500. Jesus. Specifically. I just heard God. I am making a prayer for you right now on this altar. And when I make that prayer, and the money comes, and you don't look for me, I will look for you. <laughs> we will look for you. Listen. Somebody owes you specifically $2,500. Let oh. me make a prayer on this altar. Jesus. I make a prayer on your behalf. On your behalf. Maybe you also, somebody owes you that has not, the person has not paid. Patonia. I release a prayer. I release a prayer. I release favor. I release favor. For finances. For finances. Let it be released. Let, it be. Let that money Let that be released. 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 In the name of Jesus. Let us make these declarations. Jesus. Our time is almost up. Katudia. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Right now. Right now. I declare. I declare. This month. This month of September. Of September. Shall honor me. Shall honor me. This month. This month of September. Of September shall favor me. Shall favor me. This, month, this month. This month of September. Of September. Shall bring my blessing. Bring my blessing. I declare. I declare. I release. I release. Of divine. And divine. Of divine. Of divine. Supply. Supply. Divine 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 Supply. On my life, on my life, in my family, in my family, in my business, in my business. Right now, right now, I activate, I activate, I activate, I activate my destiny helpers, my destiny helpers, my destiny helpers, my destiny helpers to come, to come from the north, from the north, from the south, from the south, from the east, from the east, and from the west, and from the west. Right now, right now, I declare, I declare, the heavens, the heavens are open, are open for my marriage, for my marriage, for my business, for my business, for my ministry, for my ministry. Right now, right now, I decree, I decree, and decree. I declare I have 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 my blessing my blessing my testimony right now 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 Shout September to remember. September to remember. I say say September to remember. September to remember. This month of September. This month of September. You shall remember. 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 Say September to remember. September to remember. Listen, if you are watching me, this is God's servant, the Apostle David Ouzu. Now listen, I want you to share a broadcast for me. If you want to sow a seed into the ministry, send it right now. If you want to tithe, those of you that tithe, let me pray for you. You send your tithe from America, from Asia, from the Caribbean, from Zambia, from Botswana, from South Africa, all over the world. Anybody that has released their tithe, that has released their partnership seed, that have given a sacrifice, an offering, I decree let the heavens open upon you. Let the heavens open. Let the heavens open upon you. Let the heavens open upon you. And give you a harvest. And give you a harvest. May God give you a harvest. May God give you a harvest. As your tithe. As your tithe. Your offering. Your offering has come. Has come. I declare. I declare. Receive a harvest. Receive the harvest. Receive a harvest. Receive the harvest. In the name. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. If you want to be a partner, partners are the people that support the ministry on a monthly basis. Send me a message and I will personally reach out to you. Listen, remember from tomorrow we are fasting. Tomorrow, in, uh, from morning time to next week on the 15th, 
The fasting goes to six to six or six to three. If you are pregnant, don't fast. If you are on medication, you can avoid fasting. If you are a nursing mother, you can do a Daniel's fast. Take fruits and vegetables and porridge and go through the day in prayer with us. As you connect today, we are about to zoom to the next session. God shall give you a harvest. Jesus. Hey! I'm in a And that's your problem. A a I know my God, yeah. Oh, to be recalled. The Alpha, on a day of rest. Eradia, my my own. Now, people more on this year. What's a between the Catabo? What did it pass up the Puma? What am I doing? My Shabo. That's a man town for near who is a pyramid. Would you not see? Would you not see? Would you Sania or Timmy Muno, or Sassinia or Oriasi, it's your running coming. We be the Abyssi run out to boom for us. And if I might, you are can take a Sayaria, a Sayaria, we say, My mommy, Kira, Jane, we did it soon for Fidia, and a Fidia, a Bubu, a Fidia, a Jerry, Yadi, it's your brahm, it's